Brian, congratulations. Another great night for you at the plate, but uh, up and down the lineup, you guys were doing a lot of damage tonight. Um, Dom was on just before you, and he was suggesting that Zach Allen tonight perhaps didn't throw enough off-speed stuff, and you guys were able to sit on the fastball. Is that your take on this as well? Um, you know, I don't know if I would necessarily, necessarily say that. Um, you know, he, he always does a pretty good job mixing it up. I just I think we went out there. I think guys got good pitches to hit, um, you know, and kind of weighed him out. Uh, didn't really chase below the zone too much tonight. I don't, if, I don't know if the numbers back that up, but that's, uh, you know, kind of what I saw. But you know, I just thought it was good. I thought we linked some, some at bats, you know, got some big hits consecutively, and uh, it was good to – Good to post a crooked number like that tonight. Also, too, Ryan, tonight you saw guys jumping into the fray that perhaps haven't had a lot of offense so far this year. Do you think that the uh, the offense is getting a little contagious maybe and some of the other guys are now getting more comfortable and settled in and able to to unleash it? Yeah, you know, I, I'm, I'm hoping that's something you guys see uh, throughout this season. You know, we're a young team, um, a lot of guys who, who haven't had a lot of at bats, so. You know, hopefully as the season goes on, guys get better with the bats and, you know, I start to put it together. So hopefully that's what you're starting to see. And uh, hopefully we do it more consistently like tonight. Thanks, Ryan. Yep. Go to Danielle. Hey, Ryan. Um, how much were you guys feeding off of each other tonight? Yeah, you know, tonight's a good night. You know, everybody's getting hits and everything like that. So, you know, you're in a good mood. It's kind of rolling into the next one. You're pulling for each other. And, uh, yeah, I, I think you just saw the, some good team baseball tonight. Um, it's hard to describe. You did this thing at one point when you got on base where you like put up both hands and kind of like flip your wrists a little bit. Um, what was that? Did that mean anything? Yeah, that's kind of just like our, uh, our baseball or our, our hit sign, I guess. Uh, it's just knocking, like knocking on a door or getting a base knock. Uh, you do one at first, you do two at second. Um, you like that little demonstration. That was kind of nice guys. Um, but anyway, I think, and you're supposed to do like a foot up at third when you do it, uh, but yeah, it's just kind of our thing, you know. We're trying to try and get it going, you know, celebrate Knox and you know, make sure everybody's kind of kind of in it together. Thank you. Yep. I'll go to Noah. Hey Ryan. Um, so obviously you didn't have any hits last night, but you had the nine game hitting streak before. So you've been hitting over 300 in the last 10 games, but also too, your on base percentage is north of 350 in that span. Can you talk about some of the more selective at bats that you've had at the plate? Yeah, you know, uh, one of my goals this year was to, to come out and be really aggressive. Um, you know, I might've taken a little, a little too far uh, for a second, but you know, now I'm kind of settling in, uh, you know, my eyes are adjusted pretty well. So, you know, I, I think I'm, I'm able to kind of go up there and uh, be a little bit more selective when I want to be and, and be aggressive when I want to be. Um, and then also too, for um, the relievers that you guys saw today, obviously you talked about Gallon a little bit but what did you happen to see out of the relievers? Because especially the non-position players, uh, they obviously weren't getting it over as well. Yeah, you know, I, maybe it was them trying to nibble a little too much, but I, I thought we did a good job of getting guys on the plate and everything like that. Obviously, Trevor had the big hit for us there, uh, hit the home run. And, you know, I, I think we just put good at-bats together, honestly, through and through. And I think we did it for a full nine innings. Thank you very much. Yep. All right, I'll finish up with Larry. Thank you, Ryan. Uh, following up a little bit with uh, what Ed and Danielle were talking about, you know, the hitters are just paying it forward tonight. What uh, brings that crescendo on in certain games at other times when you can't uh, get runners in scoring position? Um, that's a good question. I think if we had the answer, we'd, uh, we'd, we'd make an adjustment. But, you know, I – I can speak to tonight and I, I feel like, you know, we, we were doing baseball things, you know, moving runners, uh, hitting into the holes. And, uh, you know, it's, I think the only difference is executing it and, and not executing it. Is this the kind of game that really makes you feel excited for going into tomorrow's game? Yeah, definitely. You know, I, I think we kind of went out there, uh, you know, showed a little bit of, of what our true potential could be. So, uh, you know, hopefully you, you ride that momentum and uh, yeah, we got, we got a game tomorrow. So we'll be back here trying to do the same thing. All right. Thanks, Ryan. All right. Thanks, guys. All right. Thank you, Ryan. Everyone.